Hey guys, today I will be filming a storing photo cards video. It's been two months since my last one. I don't ever mean to be this long, but I just can never find the time to film. It's always so loud at my place. I don't know if you can tell by the background, but I'm actually at my parents' house right now. I literally packed up all of my binders and brought them to my parents' house. Just for the fact, I don't even touch my binders until I film these videos. I just thought, why not bring them here? Then I'll come over here on whatever weekend I decide to film. And then I'm actually in a good mood because it's quiet here, my brother's not here, and there's no loud people living upstairs. I will be filming my photo card storing videos at my parents' house from now on. But trust me, for me personally, it's a better idea just because I'm in a better mood and I have a better mindset on filming. So anyways, here we go. We got my huge pile or my huge stack of cards here. I'm very excited to put some of them away. I'm back at the nighttime. It doesn't seem like I left, but I did. I was filming earlier and I realized I forgot so many things at my house. Like I forgot my nine pocket pages and I forgot my um, Dragon Shield sleeves for my shiny and exo cards. And I even forgot some of my actual cards to store away and I wasn't set up for a lot of comebacks. So I just spent all day today going to my house, picking up that stuff and then creating labels for some comebacks and yeah so we're a little bit more prepared now and I also was kind of annoyed earlier just because I forgot things and I wasn't really in the best mood but I am much better now so <laughs> I'm glad so actually I started filming and I did put some cards away but I ended up taking them out and we're gonna redo it I didn't get that far so don't worry I'm not redoing like the whole thing so actually there's two cards I forgot to take out of my shiny binder. All right, so I took everything out. Um, again, don't worry, it wasn't too much that I put away. So we'll start off with my shiny binder. And if you remember from the last couple times, I removed the shiny solos, so it's just all shiny, no solos. The lighting sucks a little bit, so I kind of moved it. I hate it when the light shines on this and it's hard to see, but I, I did kind of move it back a bit, so it might be a little bit dark over here, but I think it looks fine. I think we're just gonna jump straight to Japanese cards. There's pretty much only one older Japanese card I'm missing and it's this one. I did see it on Mercari Japan and it was a bit expensive. Obviously if I want it, I'm just gonna have to buck up. <laughs> so I need to prepare myself for that. But we are also still working on Superstar. It's a bit hard, you know. Their newer Japanese cards are so much more expensive compared to their older Japanese cards. I don't know why, I'm guessing they made it much more limited. The struggle is definitely real, and that's why I can't even collect everything, but it is what it is. I have this card. Yes, we finally got this. Someone actually traded, and I was so very grateful for that, so thank you so much to that person that traded with me. Because, oh my gosh, we are one step closer to completing superstar just this tamen and i've also seen it on mercari japan but for like a hundred and something dollars <laughs> like 115 or something like that that's insane to me i would rather try any other way possible to get that card i don't know the only time i'd say okay to bucking up for that card is if i had a sponsorship and used the sponsorship money that's the only time i'd buck up for that but and this too it's also super expensive Damien, come on, man. <laughs> Don't do this to me. I was also going to collect the other postcards for this because they're so cute and they're like big and large selfies. But honestly, I'm just not. <laughs> and then this is just a whole mess. We will get there eventually. I just haven't been looking that closely. I think I've actually had a few people um, message me to sell the card. So I'm going to have to like search in my DMs again for you if you did reach out to me. Like I'm pretty sure someone reached out to me about this card. And I'm going to have to try and find you in my DMs. Or if you see this video right now, please reach out again. And if anyone has these, it's like the, the Onu and Key version of this. Please, like if you have it, please reach out to me. I'd love to buy it from you. Because I'd like to get that completed since we're already on the new SMCU album. <laughs> Anyways, now we'll move on to Shiny Merch. You know, I actually got their latest season's greetings. And I didn't get any pre-order cards. And that would have been nice because I could have put them right here. Maybe I'll see if I can buy the set. Now, I'll just stop talking. See, this is what happens when I film in a good mood, and then I want to just blab. And if it's about shiny, I just blab way too much. So I have, like, merch cards. I've actually been holding on to these for over a year now. It's from the last year SMCU merch. You know, it's from this, like, pin thing right here, and it came with the cards, and I've they've been sitting inside the package with the pin since last year and i finally just recently took them out i don't know why like i've been holding on to them in the package for all that time 
And when I was filming this earlier, I thought these two cards were the same. I was like, how did that happen? <laughs> but they're obviously different. So this is my chaotic merch section. This shouldn't be here. It totally doesn't fit. It's from an OST, but yeah, that I'll find a different spot for that eventually. But um, yeah, I think that's actually it for um, shiny. So we'll close this up. I forgot to mention this. I also have the 2022 SMCU cards, but I'm not going to store any of them because I haven't taken a photo of them for my Instagram yet and I, it's going to be annoying to have to take them out. But yeah, I have a lot of my like bias group cards in here, which is amazing. <laughs> Next, we'll move on to my shiny and EXO solos binder. I actually don't think I have any EXO cards because I'm basically, no, I am. I literally am completed EXO group cards. It's just the solos, obviously, which are the only active EXO at the moment. So yeah, that's pretty much all I've been taking out for EXO these days, but let's start off with shiny solos. I actually resorted Onu's dice cards and it looks much better. I'll have to put some sort of filler here because unfortunately he only did two cards for his voice album. It would have been nice if he did three. Oh well, but I'll have to put some sort of filler or whatever there. But yeah, it starts here and then it finishes off here. It's still not that satisfying, but it's much better from what I had before. These are pre-order cards. I might just find other pre-order cards to fill the space. And that's that. So... Anyways, we'll move on to Key's Gasoline album. I also resorted this and it's so much better. Oh my gosh, it's actually really annoying because I left one of the gasoline cards at my house. You know, this is what happens when I like bring stuff to my parents' house. I forget things all the time. I do actually have the whole set complete. I just left one of the um, booklet cards at my house. So the way I sorted it, I didn't put fillers because I pretty much have everything. I don't want to waste paper <laughs> by using... Um, fillers but the two green booklets here the two purple booklets here the two floppies here and then i do the three collector selfie cards here for vhs then i do the two normal vhs here and then the rest of the collector cards here that's that's how i'm doing it if you remembered i actually originally pulled this and i had it in my binders before i had to give up my own card for one of my group order joiners because they really wanted this card and you know they joined a group order for a reason to get specific cards so I wanted to give them the card they wanted and I couldn't pull it in the albums I bought, so I just rebought it for myself. No big deal. So I'll put that there and then the other green booklet one will go here. I actually have it, it's just at my house and that's so freaking annoying of me. And obviously I'll put papers there, I just don't have them here at the moment. This is what happens when I start to relocate. And then we have the other VHS collector selfie card. There we go. So that looks so much better because now the backs like match better. I love it. This is kind of, mm, but it's how we're doing things. I don't know like if I'll be able to collect Onu's Life Goes On Japanese cards. They're so expensive. It's insane. And they're also hard to find as well. <laughs> like, I think the only way I'll be able to collect them is if people offer me the cards and I feel like that's not gonna happen so anyways these are like only merch cards and that's that a reason why i stopped filming earlier is because i was so annoyed because i left my nine pocket pages at my house and then i brought them over here and i started setting up for so many comebacks and now i'm down to one so this we're gonna use this for mino's solo debut album cards but bro i'm hoping there's like i don't need any more pages because <laughs> i did set up for other albums but oh my gosh okay anyways so yes i actually pretty much almost completed his cards actually these are all the cards here i think i'm honestly only missing one and i can just trade for it because i pulled some dupes um, i'm only missing like the other this version card and i think i have everything else which is pretty good these are the k-town for you cards which are so pretty yeah we'll start with this version This is the complete version, this is the beginning version, and this is the SM Mini. And actually there's only um, two SM Minis, so that's kind of unsatisfying. But... And also the KTAP view cards, I'm just going to stick them here on this. Aren't they so pretty? I don't think I've ever shown them, because I only just recently got them. And I opened them in a haul video, which probably won't be up until much later, but... I'm just going to stick them there for now, just for the fact I'm running 
well I completely ran out of pages <laughs> but yeah that's that so there you go yeah I guess that's actually everything for shiny solo so we'll move on to nope right when I got to the exo solo and subunit section I thought oh my god I had to put away Chen's cards and I have no more papers but I went rummaging through my box of like um pages and I found this just sitting by itself I am hoping I don't need like any more <laughs> please no i don't i completely ran out of pages but okay i didn't set this up with any um fillers because the exosols are pretty obvious like how they're set up this one is from the first photo book this is from the second and this is from the no i met i mixed them up this is the digi pack these are the two like photo book versions There we go. I just kind of put them all in the first one. I didn't really check to see if there is, if they should be in any specific order, but I don't think so. But yeah, I will like fix it if they should be in a specific order, but in like this way, like they're set up in the right rows. So that's, that's that. <laughs> I'm still missing one Suho card and I'm obviously missing Schumann's cards, but I did buy a bunch of Schumann cards. So those are on the way. And I did find the very last Suho card I was missing for gray suit. So by next video, that will be complete, but we're actually completely done with this, so we'll close this up. I thought I lost my NCT binder for a hot minute, and it was just under my bed. I couldn't see it. <laughs> Anyways, also for my NCT cards, I ended up like removing full group NCT and wavy, so this is just um, NCT 127 and Dream. I did that mainly because I'm, I'm running out of room. I'm either going to have to get a super thick binder or um, get a second binder if I'm going to still collect wavy and full group but i'm just like oh my god i can't I, do, I don't want sm to do any full group things anymore please just stop it because i don't think i will continue it and that's unsatisfying to me if i don't continue <laughs> oh god anyways okay let's um also i set up properly and actually today I, I mentioned earlier if you're one of these people that watched this video the whole way through um i said earlier that i spent like all day making these like filler things i was too lazy to write them out with my hand because then my hand would cramp up and then my writing is super ugly i typed them out on the computer actually my mom helped me with it her help sped the whole process up so thank you mom for <laughs> giving me a hand but um yeah and also ignore the fact that they're all like i didn't care for them to be like fitting exactly because i take them out anyways if they were fillers like that would stay in the binder then of course i'd make them like look nicer but just for the fact i'm going to be taking them out anyways i didn't care that they're all different sizes but um anyways i actually like set this up so yes i actually don't i don't have that many two baddies photo cards to be honest and some of them aren't even like the cards i'm collecting i just i have a section where i'm putting them in my binder so we have this jhan card that one is not even like this is the target card and then this is the japanese card this is also the japanese card this Johnny, though, is an album card that I'm collecting, so that is the, not that one, the two baddies version. <laughs> See, this is easier. I have the freaking name here. I don't have to guess. <laughs> well, I pretty much already know their spots, but it just makes it so much easier where their name is showing. But that's that. See, as you can see, I'm like getting nowhere with this collection. I will make a dent in it. Don't worry, I will get somewhere with it. And then this is my page where I, I didn't make fillers for this because I'm not really collecting. These, the Korean ones I'm going to collect, but um, the Target and American and Japanese specific cards, I'm not going to collect those, but I'm going to keep the ones I have. So we're just going to like stick them here. So this one is um, Jaehan's Target card. I'll put that one next to the tail one. And then I have a Jaehan and Jungwoo Japanese version card. I'll just keep them here like that and that that's fine with me <laughs> once i get more of the korean cards they'll actually be sorted but target us and japanese i'm not actually collecting i'll just keep who i pull I actually also have these right here they're the um japanese pre-order mumo cards i have this hey chan and johnny yeah i'm just gonna stick them here for now just for now don't worry and i, I know i didn't even take them out of this plastic thing but just for now Anyways, now we'll move on to NCT Dream. We can actually finish. Um, no, we're not finishing it. We, I was so close, but I'm still working on glitch mode. I'm done, but beatbox, it's not complete. <laughs> Those cards, and that's pretty much it. 
Um, so this one I would have had a long time ago, but I accidentally bought a different one thinking it was this one, but I did recently buy this and this. So they're, they're for sure on the way. <laughs> and this one though, that was, um, this Jisung right here. Someone sold this to me. So thank you for that. We have completed this version at least. There you go. That's that. And this one's already complete. And the Mark one, bought that. There you go. So now the mixtape version is complete. So yeah, we're just about done with that. Really, I am done. They're just not in my hands right now. So we can put beatbox behind us now, finally. And then candy. But honestly, I'm excited to collect these because the cards are so freaking cute. And I have a bunch of photo book versions on the way, so it won't be that bad. I had a bunch of dupes, but I actually took those out, so we won't have to deal with that. And I'll still need to put them up for trade, but... I had like a double of this, I had like three of this one, and yeah, so I'll have to trade those, but. So we're starting off with the photo book version. Obviously, I only have Geno, and I pulled two of his, so I'll have to trade that if anyone's interested, but I'm not going to trade yet until my other ones arrive, but we'll put his away for now. There we go, one photo book version to start. <laughs> That's that, and then we have the special version. I have this... Jamin and this HN. I pulled um, two more of this. So if anyone wants to trade that, I can trade now because I don't have any more on the way. We will get there with that. We'll get there. <laughs> and then we have the Digipack version. These are all of the cards I have. I have one more Jisung and one more HN if anyone wants to trade, but I will post on my Instagram. That's the digi pack. I will um, create white papers to put on the edges here. And then we have the SM mini. I have almost everything. I'm just missing Chunla and Jisung. I have an extra dungeon. I think I actually have two dungeons, I believe so. But anyways. There we go. So just missing those two for the SM mini. Thankfully, I do have cards to trade for that. And yeah, that's everything for NCT. Well, yeah, that, that's everything, but I have one merch card. And it's the Sanrio card. <laughs> Sanrio merch. And we will add that. I do, I do have a space. I do. I think so. Yep. All my other Sanrio merch is here. It's, I don't think I've ever showed it. I should probably show it. I might have to take this back home with me later because I want to take a picture of it, but I bought the cute little glass mug um, that has Jahan's character on it and it came with this cute card. Uh, I need to take a picture of that for my Instagram, but um, I'll take this home with me later to take a picture for my Instagram, but that's that. And yeah, actually, oh, I should move that up there so it fits better, but I can't be bothered right now. <laughs> Anyways, that is actually completely everything for NCT. Well, I also have this little Japanese like pre-order card. So I don't know if that will fit in here. Oh, it does fit. Okay, we'll just stick that there for now. <laughs> it's kind of random to be there. But anyways, that's that. And we're done with this binder now. Well, actually, I have my wavy cards. But you know what? They're not set up. And as you know, I'm completely out of nine pocket pages right now um so we're just gonna leave those out for now they'll have to be sorted in here next time <laughs> next let's do stray kids they're always fun to sort to be honest because it i don't know it's just so satisfying jyp cards are always so great like i thoroughly enjoy collecting stray kids and itsy i have like the funnest time collecting their cards because they're all so cute <laughs> these right here are the album cards that I was missing and this actually completes everything which is nice. What are we starting with? This one is the pink version. Okay. Got all of the remaining cards here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Help. That one's all done. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to like cut the white papers. I haven't done that for a hot minute. Oh, I, I have them there, but I haven't done them for this comeback. And then we have the black back version. That's actually so interesting how this worked out. These three are all doing the heart that way, and these three are all doing them this way, and then these two in the middle are doing it together. That's kind of like awesome how that worked out. <laughs> and then we have the white version. I was just missing Jungin's here. Also, I just realized I left this card at my house and I can't go get it because I'm not there right now. Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. I'm so mad at myself because, you know, I went back a second time today and I was like, you're gonna get this. You gotta get this. And I freaking forgot it. I hate myself. This is for the uh, case versions, but I completely ran out of pages. There's quite a bit of cards here. I have enough for the selfie cards, but I completely ran out of pages for the other set of cards, which is really annoying. It was either I didn't put away some cards like the, the non-selfie from the case album, or I grab my other crappy pages and put them in this for now and then I'll replace them later when I get my new ones. So we're gonna go with that so I can actually store them away. Yeah, these are like so old and they're a different brand. I prefer the Ultra Pro ones, but this is just for now. <laughs> uh, gosh. Yeah, like these pages are a bit shorter, so the um, dragon shield sleeves don't really fit in these. They totally stick up. Thankfully, these little, um, what are these called again? <laughs> um, well, these sleeves, the uh, thinner ones, they fit better in these because they're a bit smaller, so it kind of works out. But anyways, remind me to replace this page later once I get more Ultra Pro pages. But um, that's that for um, Stray Kids, like regular album cards. And I can, like, why not? I don't really tend to put their pobs away on camera because it's just a whole freaking mess. But I actually do have a whole set of MMT pobs, so we can put that away. Let's stick it here. Remind me to, <laughs> to replace this. Aren't they so freaking cute? The little, like, lollipops? They're adorable. That's that. Isn't that adorable? I'm so glad I was able to get the full set for that. So cute. Those came from the case versions. That's why I have the whole set because I ordered everyone's case version. And yeah, so that's actually it for Stray Kids. So we'll close this up. Let's do Red Velvet and Itzy next. They're always so fun. I love collecting both Itzy and Red Velvet so much. I really need to change this part to Itzy. <laughs> but honestly, I feel like eventually they'll have to be separated. These pages I've created are, are so old. Like th at this time, EXO and Red Velvet were in the same um, binder. And like I'm, I've been too lazy to redecorate them because I switch my binders up so much. There's quite a bit. <laughs> I think I actually did set up for a silky. I'm hoping so, just for the fact I completely ran out of freaking pages. Let's skip over to um, birthday. I actually set up for that, but I wrote my own little sticky notes. I will say right now I was able to, where is it? No, feel my rhythm. I was able to find, sorry, I'm trying to get there, this card, this Irene, I found it and I bought it. So finally feel my rhythm is completely done and now we have birthday so we start with the photo book versions i have everyone but yeti so i need to trade for that and it's funny because i actually forgot i had this wendy then i ended up trading one of my silgies for it and i don't even need it because i just i forgot i had it i have another silgie and trading that for the yeti so we'll get them all eventually This album was actually not that hard to complete this time because they did so many member versions and we're all buying all the member versions and it's easier to pull the cards now. This is the only one I'll, I'll probably struggle with 
because I only bought two member versions for that. And these are the cards I pulled. Both of these cards are stunning, aren't they? <laughs> so pretty. I was at the K-pop store, like my local K-pop store, um, just earlier this month, and I wanted to pick up another cake version, but they wouldn't let me choose a version. They made me draw from a bucket a name, and whoever I chose I was forced to buy, but I said I already have two of them, I just want to make sure I get one I don't have, and I was okay drawing as long as it was one I don't have, and they still wouldn't let me, <laughs> so I just didn't buy it. I guess it's their loss, but um, I was kind of not happy about that because I really wanted to get another one to pull another card, but... Anyways, now we'll do the digi packs. Yeah, I only have three here because I pulled so many dupes, <laughs> but I am trading them, so we'll get them eventually. There you go, that's that. And then we have the SM mini version, and I also have three right here. So I am getting everything else I'm missing in trades. The only one I still need to buy is the cake version, but again, we'll get there eventually. I take things slow and some, some of you guys realize that and I like taking things slow because I don't stress about it then. Oh wait, I also have the K-Town for you cards. Shoot, here's the K-Town for you cards. I'm missing Silky, but I was thinking of just buying hers possibly, but um, as we know, I said earlier, I ran out of pages, so. You know, I'll just stick them in one of these crappy, <laughs> crappy old pages and I'll just have to replace it later. That's that. Remind me to replace that. And then Sylvie's solo. I'm hoping I set up for it. Oh my god, I did. So actually this kind of worked out. I started it off here after joy's album because the cards like you know like it, it ended here and i had a whole row here but starting it off here really works out because it all like finishes on one page here so that really worked out what do i have here so this is going to be the photo book version i only have one here because i bought one photo book version and this is the one i pulled oh i have to take this out i can use those though that's that and then we have the case version. I also only have, oh, that's not even the case version. I only have one for that as well. We'll get there. Then we have the special versions with the red back. So I have the red back ones completed. And then we have the special version with the white back. And I also have those completed. See, that really worked out. I like saving space and continuing it off from here saves me space and I just like how that worked out. So that's that. That is Silgi's 28 Reasons. Oh, I was going to say I should fit the red velvet K-Town for you cards somewhere back here, but I literally have no room. <laughs> so we're not going to do that. And now we'll move on to Itzy. I like fully set up for Itzy. Well, actually not fully. I didn't include the lenticulars from the... Um, Okay, we're, we're actually not done here, so. I think it's just the neon cards and the lenticulars I didn't set up for, but like all the units and everything else I did. But let's uh, start with the older, the older album first, so checkmate. That's all of this here, I believe. So I have one random pre-order card, but yeah, we have mix of the regular album and the special edition unit cards. I actually don't have everything with me right now because I only just recently. These are all the cards I have here. So do we have, no, the Leah Rose I traded for. This I bought recently, so I don't have that with me. And I think both of these I recently bought, they're not here. Again, ignore the way I spelt this. I know I spelt it wrong, but I didn't care to change it. Okay, there it is, we got this one right here. And it's not even champagne, it's martini, but whatever. Okay, and then we have the Leah Cheek one. And we have the Yeji cheek one. And the Yuna 
martini one. I'm not collecting these, by the way, but maybe if I see like two other ones, I'll buy them just to put them here and fill the space, but I'm not like fully collecting them. And then we have the unit cards. I'm just gonna stick them in here. I I don't think this is all the rest. That's a pre-order card. I don't think this is all the rest, but it's a lot of them. Well, actually I'll stick them, like I'll do like the versions matching. Oh, it's just, oh, there's only two types. Okay, <laughs> I guess we'll start with the green one. Usually there's 10 Itzy um, unit cards, so there's probably going to be, I think there's only two more missing, I'm guessing so. And there's no dupes here, is it? I didn't mess up, did I? <laughs> I don't think so, they're all different, right? Yeah, okay. So those are the special edition um, unit cards. And then yeah, there's that. And now, oh, we'll, we'll put this away later, it's a pop. Then we have all of their Cheshire cards. Thankfully I set it up, yes, <laughs> with my mismatched and not like cut properly fillers but anyways it's better than not having it set up so we'll sort the cards i'll take out all of the regular selfies okay we'll we'll do units and then neon cards okay these are these are like pre-order make star cards these are the special edition or the limited edition cards. We'll just put those to the side for now. I think I actually did set up for that though, but the neon cards, I don't think I set up for. So we'll just put those to the side and we'll source the um, cards. So I did like selfie. I, it was hard to like label them. I did like selfie one, which I believe is like this kind of a card. The selfie one is them in the black outfits. And then the selfie two is them in like colorful outfits. Like um, this, for example, she's wearing red. So, and she's wearing like, different colors i couldn't just say like one color outfit because they're all wearing kind of different colors i'm blabbing so much so i'm hoping i'm making sense cat ear you know like they're doing a, the cat ear pose that's what that is and then the other one was um the sunglasses yeah i don't think i have any of the sunglasses oh i do i have chaegyeong so there you go anyways i will stop blabbing i'm so sorry so this is the cat ear one but we'll just set that to the side this is the Dujin cat ear. This Yeji is the selfie too. Okay. They're so cute. And then this is the Chaeryeong selfie one. And this is the Chaeryeong um, selfie sunglasses. There you go. I should have wrote limited on these because the crown pose and the L pose, uh, for example, right here, I just called it L pose. I don't know if that's, there's an actual name for it, but um, these are the limited edition, but it fit best that way. But I didn't set up for the lenticulars because there, no, there was no room for it. <laughs> now I'm like stuttering. Her crown pose one and her L pose one. There you go. I don't think these will be too hard to collect. And then it ends up like that. And then we have the unit cards. Here they all are. There you go. Those are all the unit cards. I had a dupe of this one and I believe this one. So I did trade those. Obviously not here yet. Oh, and yeah, I put this one on the back because that's how it goes. I'm just gonna stick this one here. I know it doesn't, it's not that good because it's like completely out of order. The rest here, like the Make Star cards and the Neon cards and the Lenticular, I'll have to save for another time because as we know, I ran out of pages, unfortunately, but um, that's fine with me. We're done here and we'll close this up. Next, we'll move on to this binder. I really do miss collecting AB6, but you know, like brand new music has been going too crazy with cards i literally can't keep up i just really had to put a hold on their cards unfortunately they were so fun to collect so i definitely like one day if i can want to get back into them but unfortunately it's on a hold at the moment but then we have ss9 i actually don't have anything even though they did have a comeback and i'm missing this freaking insan kino card oh my god it's so expensive i don't know if i'll ever get it i want to get it though but 
they did have a comeback and I still didn't freaking sort it. So whatever. I'm not even mad I don't have cards because I didn't sort it properly. I'm obviously only collecting Tang this comeback because my other two biases are military. But I don't have them anyways. But I did buy the rest. So I will sort this properly when they arrive. But yeah, I guess we don't even need this binder. Let's do this one next. I have this like... um. I was gonna say Wee Eye. Well, it's Johan, but when he was an X one, I have this on here. But Wee Eye is not even in this binder. Ace. I'm still actually missing Ace cards, as you can see. But you know what? I don't know if I'll ever get them. Like the Changer cards and the higher cards. Not higher. What's this album name? Anyways, the title track was higher, but I will get those. I'm just like, oh my god, I'm so frustrated that that they're not that easy to come across. But anyways, um, that's that. But the boys. Here we go. The Boys is also one of my most satisfying, like, collections in my opinion. It's not satisfying though when I'm missing some cards, like this, for example. That's not satisfying because it's really hard to find, but I know I will eventually get it, but... Anyways, someone sold these to me, or no, one of them, I think, and then also someone sold that to me. So those are on the way, finally. I'm blabbing so much, probably because I'm in a good mood. <laughs> Okay, and also, I need to get this Kevin card. Someone said they'd gift it to me, and they told me not to buy it, but I don't think they're going to send it, so that, that's totally fine. I'm No need to send me cards, but um, I might just have to buy that now. But anyways, I completely set up for Be Aware, which is their Whisper album. Yes, oh my gosh. Yeah, I like dropped my cards, and now they're all completely out of order. I hate this, but... <laughs> anyways, we have all of my The Boys cards here. Yeah, we're gonna try our best to sort this because, um, I just dropped them out of order. Because, <laughs> like, I don't, it's hard to tell, like, A and B, like, what, what, which one is the orange one from? I don't even know. Thank god I have the template, like, literally open. This is an old template with not everything on it, but the actual album cards are on here. Thank god, I'm so happy. Okay, we're starting with Kevin. Let's just, first of all, let's just bring out his cards. I also have the platform cards, but I can't remember if I set up for that, but we'll see in a second. But anyways, I don't have that many. I did buy a bunch of cards and they're on the way, but thankfully the boys cards, like the members I collect except for Sonu, aren't that expensive. So it's pretty, it's pretty fun collecting them, to be honest, because they're not that expensive, minus Sonu. Anyways, we have these cards, so I think it's actually from the first version. I see it now, I see it now. This is the whole denial page. Let's see. And this one here is A. Okay, we're, we got it now. I can see that. I see the template now. When I'm all sorted out, it's not that bad. Then we have my Hangyan cards. Um, yeah, we'll we'll put these away when we get to this. <laughs> we'll stick with the selfie cards for now. And I think one of these is the special, like... Yeah, that's this one. Whose dog is barking outside? Can you hear that? Please, I hate dogs. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't hate them. Oh my god, now like the whole neighborhood dogs are barking. Anyways, we got to these. So now I have to like, please tell me I have the Hangyeon template as well. Oh my god, I do love this. Okay, I just realized it's not from Denial. It's from the document. So that is this one. Almost messed up there. Okay, almost messed up there for a second. And then we have my Sonu cards. I have more for him because I stress about him and I try and trade the most for him. Anyways, we got the Sonu template as well. This one. Oh my gosh, okay. Look at all the cute, pretty colors. Are these all from the same version? This actually is the whole set for the Desire. Wow, they're all, each member I have is all from different versions. <laughs> that's A, that's B, and this is C. Cool. All right, that's that. <laughs> and then we have all the other cards here. These are the emotion cards, so we can put those away. Everyone's emotion card here. Oh, but there's emotion from different versions. Oh my God, I'm not, am I gonna ever complete this? Stay tuned. Are you guys just as confused as me? No, I'm just kidding. I'm good. I don't think I messed up, right? I didn't mess up. We're good. We're on track of things, okay? Then we have the special kit and the film cards. Thankfully, there's only one type of film card. And I have Sonu and Kevin's here, and someone said they'd send me Hangyeon, so 
thank you for that. <laughs> well, actually, I'm trading with them, but they said they'd add it in for me in the trade, so that was really nice of them. And then we have the special kit cards. I have this Sonu and this Hangyeon. Now I need to check which version they are. The Hangyeon is version A, so we'll put his here. This one is version B, so we'll put you here. Well, I'm actually like on top of things, this comeback. I feel like the last comeback, I was a hot mess. Well, I'm pretty much a hot mess for every The Boys comeback because I just cannot deal. I didn't set up for the platform, but I actually do have like one Kevin, so I don't really have much. So I'll just save them for next time, to be honest. And I also have these freaking scary ass Make Star cards, like Chani, help. <laughs> I cannot. These two, I literally cannot. But I'm going to save those to put away. But that's what my The Boys collection is looking like so far. <laughs> literally getting nowhere. But don't worry, I did buy like a bunch of cards. So we'll have a lot to put away next time. But that's where I'm currently at with this collection. And they're literally having a comeback soon. And I'm going to cry. Anyways, okay, that's it for The Boys. Let's move on who else is in here is it treasure i think it's treasure and i'm not set up for them and i just i just don't know actually someone recently well i haven't bought them yet but someone is selling me like literally all the remaining cards i'm missing from this album so that will like that will help me in like actually getting started on um the new album which i haven't even set up for so we're just not gonna do this right now because actually i literally don't have pages <laughs> so we're not doing treasure but we will be doing them next time don't worry treasure stands and next we have 17 this is also monster x no it was monster x but i actually ended up putting them in an a5 binder but we're gonna move on to 17. you know this was a fun time when i used to collect ot13 <laughs> that was a more simpler time and now Pletus is like doing freaking like five plus versions anyways here we are <laughs> you know i'm also going to struggle with this album as well because some of the cards like some of joshua's cards and some of um wanu's cards are so expensive i wasn't expecting that so i'm kind of like crying inside <laughs> and like i'm already buying so much because like what is all of this oh my god like my bank account hates me so much Okay, oh my gosh, and I realized I also have to take the Wanu cards out because he's in an A5 binder. These are Vernon's um, Weaver's cards, and I don't really have a like section set up for the Weaver's cards because I wasn't bothering for the longest time. But anyways, and this is the carrot version. Okay. Eek. All right, we'll start with you, sir. EP1. Okay, you can go here. Also, let's hope I didn't up and buy the same cards twice, but we are I've already done that multiple times. Like, okay, thank god, that's different. <laughs> like, I don't trust myself. Ooh, that's different too, cool. Okay, we're done with EP1 now. This is the start of EP2 right here, okay. I have this Joshua, that is different, good. I also have to double check to make sure I didn't mess up. Okay, that is different. Cool, we, we just completed Vernon for the EP2. We got you, sir. Uh, just need to make sure it's different. Okay, that is good. And I need to make sure that, oh, I feel like it's the same. Oh, it's different, good, okay. Cause they, some of them look so similar. Oh, we love how my, my sweatshirt here is totally matching. <laughs> love that. Okay, that's it for EP2, and we're starting um, EP3 here. I have this stunning Joshua card. It is the absolute most beautiful card I've ever seen. And actually, these cards, Joshua's EP3 cards, are kind of expensive. So I'm like crying inside. I don't know if I'll be able to complete them very easily. Uh, anyways, because as you can see, I have like none of his because they're so expensive. <laughs> 
Okay, we have this Vernon EP3. This one I think I bought twice, but I did take it out. Oh, wait. Oh, sorry, That's I only had one EP3. My bad. This is his EP4. EP4 is starting here. Is my setup here giving you guys a headache or what? Because <laughs> sometimes it gives me a headache. Also, I, I feel like some of Joshua's EP4 cards are also kind of expensive. Eh, that is different. Good. Good. Thankfully, like, I have most of them at this point. What else we got here? We have this one. Yes, it's different. <laughs> I feel like I don't trust myself. Now we're starting on EP5. I don't have any more EP4s. That's starting right here. Um, please tell me you are different, sir. Okay. Yeah, looking different so far. Good. Okay, and then we have this sir right here. And he is different. Good. <laughs> it's like panic time when I bring it out. It looks similar, but it's actually slightly different. Just moved their head slightly. <laughs> Okay, that's actually everything. All the rest here are carrot cards and two of them are Wanu and that is like not here. So we got this this um carrot Jungan. Why am I missing so many? Oh no, this is the start of No, okay. <laughs> Never mind. I'm I'm just going crazy. Why am I missing so many EP5? Do I Oh, I do need this. Okay, good. <laughs> this is actually my favorite card from the the uh, carrot version. It's so cute. And there we go. The carrot version is all complete for that. Now, oh, this is my weaver section. This, what are you? Why are you here? Oh, that's, oh, I, I know what this is. This is a keynote card. We're going to move you to the top here. And then we'll put um, Vernon's weaver set right under Joshua. And I just need, like, Jungan. Obviously, like, Wanu, I'd, I, I'd like to get his too, but the higher priority is um, Jungan. So I would love to get his, but thankfully I have those those members. You know, at this point, I don't even care to cover that. <laughs> it doesn't even matter. Okay, now let's um do these cards. I'll have to take Wanu out, though. I only had one Wanu anyways. And also, one of these cards is a target card. Which one is it? This one. This is a target card, so I just don't really know what to do with that. But anyways. Okay, let's just freaking sort this. These are the only two regular cards I have. Okay, you can go here. <laughs> sure. Like, I'm confusing myself with my setup, but no, this makes sense. Because we got the two new beginnings, then the new heights starts there, and that continues here. And this is the compact, but I was actually going to switch this around to make the version colors match. You know, like, I was going to put the the um, this version compact down here, and then this will all be, like, the blue one. I, I was going to do that, then I forgot. Let me have the Joshua compact here. Oh, no, that one goes here. And this one goes here. Okay, seeing them all in here, I feel better. <laughs> like, I was kind of stressing for a hot minute with this collection, but we're not missing that much for like my top three. It's like Wanu being added in there, it like throws me off. <laughs> like, I feel like I'm so behind with a fourth member, but with my top three, we're not doing too bad. I'm gonna have to like stick this somewhere because I don't collect the target cards, but I traded for it anyways, because why not? <laughs> So you know what, we're just gonna like, I don't know, there has to be a spot, like an available spot somewhere. We're gonna stick him with the other members that I've been randomly gatekeeping from other albums. <laughs> like just please ignore this part of the video to be honest. Anyways, let's close this up and I'll bring out my Wanu A5 binder. Cause I'm honestly not even sure if I sorted the cards for him. Oh, 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 oh. please don't do this to me. Like I think his Face the Sun cards are sorted but i'm not sure about the um sector 17 cards obviously i don't have any older cards for him because it's kind of a struggle right now it's actually pretty satisfying having one member in the a5 binder because there's like four cards per version so it's just like that's the first version that's the second you know it's it's so easy wait i don't even have the first version in here 
Do I even have any of his version one cards? I do, and I don't have any pages with me. Wait, I have to. I don't. <laughs> I don't have any A4 pages with me at the moment. And I don't have any extras in here. Because, you know, as we all know, I'm, I recently moved my binders to my parents' house. So, we're unfortunately going to have to stick him here for now. But this should be on its own page. I'm so annoyed right now that I didn't bring everything. You know, his EP5, I think, cards are so expensive. I've seen some of them go for like $25 plus dollars. What are you doing? Never mind, we can't put this here anyways because... I got this card. <laughs> you know, it's not going good right now. It's not going good right now. So we're going to have to unfortunately stick this here. Even though this should be on his own page. It should be the first page. But please just... It's only because I recently moved everything to my parents' house. And I missed some things. But we got this. <laughs> this satisfyingly fits on the last section here. There you go, so his carrot versions are complete at least. You know, please, someone help me please with his um, EP5 versions. Does anyone have them and want to sell them to me for normal price? That'd be awesome. <laughs> and then thankfully I don't really have like much for this because we'll just stick you here. I promise I'm going to like just completely set up his cards much better when I do. But anyways, that's it for Wanu. I'm so sorry about this whole section here. The Wanu stands, I'll do better next time. <laughs> Very last binder we'll bring out for today's video is my Wii Johan binder. Because I have a couple cards, and I do have some Wii cards, but I have like barely any Johan. He's the only member I collect. Um, like this was the only selfie card I pulled from the album. I also have this card. This like ID card. But I'm not actually set up for his, like, for Wee Eyes' latest album, so I can't really... Well, I can, like, stick it in here, but it's not really properly sorted. But this card, which is this one, I have it! Someone sold it to me. Thank you so much to the person that sold this to me, because this was really bothering me. <laughs> the fact I didn't have this card, and, like, I thought I had it, but I didn't, but now I do. Oh my gosh, finally. Is that properly sorted on the back? Why is, like... Oh, okay, I guess that's whatever. <laughs> the The way that, like, broke is kind of annoying, but... Anyways, oh my gosh, we did it. But let us... Sorry, I'm, like, doing this with one hand. <laughs> now I'm becoming lazy. Um, yeah. His solo cards is, like... That's a whole other story. But... Yeah, we... we oh... Oh, I have one extra page here. I could have used that for Wanu, but you know what? We'll use that to stick this this card in here. Cause and also he's not even in the <laughs> he should be in the um the heart sleeve. Cause I usually tend to put Johan's cards in the heart sleeves. But you know what? We're a whole mess today. And I promise I will be more properly sorted for this next time. <laughs> but um anyways, that's actually pretty much everything for the video. I have a bunch of other cards, like I have not put away, like I have BI and I have like all my other um, Wii Eye cards, and then I have like a bunch of, look how many Wii Eye cards I have. And then I have a bunch of Wanus cards here that I have not put, I even have like their older cards from um, Trickster I haven't put away, and then I have some Pobs of Wii Eye. This, I've just been like, I have the Rose here. Look how, look how many old, um, sorry, this is their Trickster album, their old Wanus cards here. I just haven't been putting them away because I just don't have the room right now. I also have my black pink cards here and some like Espa and whatnot. I'm actually saving to put these away. I'm going to do a Jenny sorting video. I've actually been starting to set everything up. So I will do a Jenny, like starting my Jenny collection video. So that's why I have been holding on to some of these. But anyways, that's pretty much the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.